Hey, what's going on guys? Minty Derps here. I'm back with another opening. Today I'm going to be opening up the Sceptile EX10 doing a pack battle, well actually a tin battle versus Jeff from the Poke Capital and this is a viewer's choice battle. Now if you guys do not know what a viewer's choice battle is, basically you guys watch both our sides. Our pulls don't really matter. You guys just decide who wins depending on certain cards they pick. So you know, like let's say I pull more EXs than Jeff, then maybe you guys decide I win or maybe you just like Jeff's video better than you guys pick his so basically that's what it's going to be and we today we're going to use the Sceptile UX 10 basically we went with this 10 because I do not have the Sceptile UX promo so I figured why not go ahead and um get an EX out of it and plus I had already opened these two the Blaziken and Swampert ones on my channel before so I went ahead and just you know did all three so this is a Hoenn Power EX 10 and then basically in the back says, get ready for Hoenn Power EX style. Evolve your, evolve your skills and expand your collection with the Pokemon trading card game Hoenn Power 10. Because each of these collector tins contains one of the most famous Pokemon EX in all of the Hoenn region. Speedy Sceptile EX, Fire Bright Blaziken EX, and of course my favorite, Unstoppable Swampert EX. Unless it's a grass type move of course. But we have a grab... Okay, the end, the end of it is grab one today and power up your game. And of course, all of these comes with one of the promo, four packs, and the online TCG, TCG code. Woo! I'm really excited today, guys. But enough talking. Let's go ahead and crack into one of these tins. And I do have, like, a small little story. I had actually bought one of these. but And I started recording. And I had just previously went to San Jose. And I was doing quite a bit of filming over there. And when I came back, I didn't notice my SD card did not have any memory. And I was recording the video... And I don't even know why I didn't notice, but the video had shut off on me. So, yeah, I had to go and buy a new one, which kind of sucked. But, hey, it's all right. We got the tin with us now. So, this one is the one that matters. So, let's go ahead and put that Septile tin right there. We have here the Septile EX promo with the move Agility. Flip a coin if heads prevent all effects of attacks, including damage done to this Pokemon during your opponent's next turn, which does 20 damage and strong slash... This Pokemon can't use Strong Slash during its next turn, but it does do 130 damage. Let's go ahead and put that in the sleeve. Let's use my girlfriend's panda sleeves. She has them in the panda box. They've been here at my house for about a week. These are the panda sleeves. They're really adorable. So why not go ahead and use them? And let's set that promo up in the back. Move the knife out of the way because we don't want to get cut today. All right. So here we go. We have two Roaring Skies, a Primal Clash, and a Phantom Force. And of course, like always on my channel, we go oldest to newest. So let's go ahead and start off with this Phantom Forces pack. Now remember guys, this is a viewer's choice battle. So if you like what I pull here, make sure to vote for me. And of course, then I will be the winner and I can, you know, brag in front of Jeff. No, I'm just kidding, Jeff. Good luck to both of us. And here we go. We have a Swadaloon, Battle Compressor, Loud Dread, Dead Dene, Joltik. That's a really nice artwork right there. This Joltik is really adorable. We have an Alamomola, Skarmory, Rog and Rolla, Reverse Hollow of a Muna, and the last card is a Galvantula, regular rare. Not too great. The first tin that I had opened was really nice, guys. I got a full art Heracross, a Mega Rayquaza, and then I got two reverse rares and a hollow. So if I would have used that one against Jeff in this battle, geez, I would have won that one for sure. But I'm not too sure how this tin is going to go off. So here we go, going on to Primal Clash, I believe it was. And let's see if we can get a Mudkip or a Swamper. We have a Matt Gargo. Seedra, Gorbis, Meryl, Surskit, Corfish, Horsey, Trap Inch. We have a Reverse Hollow of an EXP Share and an Azumarill Regular Rare. So these first two packs didn't really come with anything great at all, but hopefully Roaring Skies has some amazing pulls. Of course, one of those Shamans would be amazing. So let's go ahead and do the card trick. Three to the bottom. And here we go. Starting off here with an Unpheasant. Fletchender, Altaria, Taylo, Electrike, Bagon, Ninkata, Pit of, Reverse Hollow of a Trainer's Melt, and the last card is a Togekiss, guys. We are going 0 for 3. Jeez, can this last pack bring us an EX, guys? To at least, you know, you know at least get some votes, I guess? I mean, who knows? Let's, let's see what this last pack can get us, guys. Here is the code. Feel free to comment down below what you guys get from that code. Ooh. Let's see what we get. We have a Double Dragon Energy, Tropius, Skyfield, Wingle, Dratini, 
Electric, Swablu, Bagon, Reverse Holo of an Articuno. That's pretty awesome. It's that Ancient Trait, and this is honestly really overpowered. Um, I believe when you knock out any Pokemon, you take two prize cards, um, even if it's not an EX. So that is honestly really cool in the TCG. And the last card is a Deoxys Holo. Wow, so, you know, Roaring Skies did its work. We didn't get that beautiful Shaman, but we did get... This amazing Deoxys and of course this beautiful Articuno. Really great fan of this artwork. And of course we do get this Septile EX promo, which now I sadly have two. So one's up for trade, guys, if you want it. So there you guys have it. These are honestly the best pulls we got, which was in the last pack. So that's all I'm going to show off right there. The rest of these cards, these just go in my duplicate box, but whatever. So there you guys have it. This is the viewer's choice battle against Jeff from the Poke Capital. Make sure to watch both sides and then comment down below. On either of our channel which um, tin you think was better or who you prefer to win and then we'll go off from there and whoever wins we get bragging rights so I'm coming for you Jeff um, hopefully these last two cards beat your tin you know who knows so I'll put um, Jeff's channel down in the description below if you guys are coming from Jeff's channel make sure to comment down below who you guys think win and of course comment subscribe to my channel for more openings Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and then that's basically all guys. This is Minty Derps and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.